to downtown Portland, picking cigarette tobacco out of the ashtrays and putting it in a plastic baggie, going back to that homeless shelter at night to lay on the gym floor a long ways from that high school athlete, a long ways from that kid that had that dream in his life, a long ways from that place when I was inspired for life ahead. How do you come back from that? There's no challenge in life that you can't overcome. Making on those vaporizers. You know, those kids sneaking off, drinking a little bit, smoking a little bit. What I'm going to tell you is you're already starting down that road. This isn't funny. This is serious to me, guys. This is serious. Because a lot of my friends don't get to be here right now. And that's where it all started for most of us. You might think it's fun and games and cool, but the problem is it's hard. It's difficult. It's, it's hard to be a high school kid today. All the pressure on you to try to fit in, to try to be part of. The pressure's on, and it's hard. It takes a lot of courage, a lot of courage to muster up, to make a decision that I want to find my own identity. I want to carve my own path. I don't want to go down that road. Imagine what I could have done if I had that 20 years back. I destroyed everything around me. Separated me from my family. That's drug, drug's job. That's its job. Separate you, disconnect, drive a wedge in. And that's what it did for so long. There's too many kids out there that don't understand the damage that it's doing. Another kid died the other day because one of those damn vaporizers blew up in his face, man. Another one down, another good kid. And I'm sure he was like me, didn't think that would happen to him. Tough loss there at the end. 20 years gone, just like that. That's what it really looks like. That's what it was like for me. That guy wasn't going to be on your team. Nobody wants that guy on their team. Long ways from that kid. 20 years, I don't get to rewind my life. I don't get to do it again. Choices that I made separated me from what was really important in life. Those of you sneaking out of class to go vape, those of you making those tough choices, it's taking you away from what's really, really important in life. And um, go out there and help others. And what we say, and what we've been saying all year, um, if you kind of come in and talk to me or anything like that, and, and I don't hold that against anybody, because everybody needs a little bit of a 